Okay, guys, Richard Holden here, and this is it. This is the test you've been waiting for. This is the one to settle it all. Who's the baddest in the land? Cathedral Port versus Wreck Port Cylinder Heads. We got the Cathedral Port Mafia versus the Wrecking Crew. This is the most crazy epic test ever devised. We measure airflow, port volumes. We even dyno tested these babies, normally aspirated and turbocharged. This is it. This will decide it. So let's get it on. Okay, guys, I don't know what his problem was. But the reality is that no single test is going to tell you whether every cathedral port head is better than every rectangular port head. I mean, the reality is you'd probably use those on different applications. I mean, if you take a look at this test, we compare what is probably the least powerful cathedral port head to the most powerful rectangular port head. And I know when I say that, some of you guys are thinking, hey, has he ever heard of an LS7 head? Obviously, I have. But that head was designed for a 4125 bore. And since we tested these heads on a 4065 bore LS3, that makes the factory LS3 head the most powerful factory head you can put on that combination. So before we get to what are probably predictable results, let's take a look at our test motor. LS3 crate motor with a cam upgrade. Healthy comp hydraulic roller cam. Beehive spring upgrade. Fast intake for 317s. Stock intake for LS3s. Now right off the bat, I know some of you are wondering, why do we install a fast manifold on the 317 heads? Well, as you know, the factory LS3 manifold is about as good as you can get. But we wanted to provide the equivalent of an LS3 manifold on the cathedral port heads. After all, we don't want to make this even more one-sided than it already is. So how one-sided is it? Well, let's take a look at the two heads, including valve sizes, port volumes, and flow numbers. Check out the power gains. Then we added the turbo with an intercooler, dual turbo smart wastegates. Okay guys, so right off the bat, did we answer the question whether all rectangular port heads are better than all cathedral port heads? Obviously not. In fact, the only question we answered was whether a set of factory LS3 heads make more power than a set of factory 317 heads. And that answer is yes, both turbocharged and normally aspirated. So after running this test, guys are going to ask, hey, why didn't you test the 243 or 799 heads? Well, we know from previous testing those heads will make more than a set of 317s. But whether they make more than an LS3 head, that's another test for another day. So if you like what you saw, make sure to like and share and do all that great stuff. I'm Richard Holder. Thanks for watching.